All right, everyone, welcome back. So today I wanted to show you the quickest way, the best way to rank up your season pass to 100. Now, this isn't new. This is old news, but there is a lot of, a lot of new players that will join this game for season 10 uh, who won't know how to do this. And so today I just wanted to do a quick video, hopefully, just showing you how to gain the fastest amount of XP as fast as possible so that you can get to that season pass 100. Now, you may have noticed um, where I'm stood. I'm actually in the summit here. So um, what you wanna do uh, for this is head to the summit. Now, start at level one, run for on normal difficulty. And when you get to level 10, what you're looking for is this exact encounter. Okay, um, this encounter here, you can see it, I'll, I'll run out here guys, I'll, I'll show you my playthrough of it anyway, but you want this exact encounter, you'll have two, it'll bring up basically two um, bosses or whatever I say, um, and it has to be this one, okay, so if it's not this one, then what you're going to want to do is you're just going to want to, what I normally do is uh, I equip, like for this character, I've got a concussion grenade, and I've also got on... Uh, Sticky bomb as well, explosive sticky bomb. And what I'll do is I'll fire the sticky bomb down. I'll just show you here what I'll do. Fire the sticky bomb down on the floor. Okay, throw your grenade out. Normally, wait for it just to stagger, then detonate. There you go, dead. Easy. Uh, that'll kill you instantly. Respawn. Um, and just keep respawning until you get this exact encounter. And remember, this is on floor 10. And that's important to note. So what I did is I started on normal difficulty. I went up to floor 10 like this. I got this encounter. I killed myself. Went back to the summit or, or exited back to the um, return back to the lobby. And then I changed it to challenging. Um, and then I applied some directives. So as you can see on the left there, I've got five directives. Of course, you can do heroic if you want with directives. It's, it's really up to you. Obviously, the more directives you have, the more experience you get. Obviously, the higher the difficulty, the more experience you get. But I've gone for challenging with five directives because I found that this is the quickest way for me to run through this content. If I go on heroic with these directives, I just find that it's not as enjoyable. It's not as quick. Um, and to me, it doesn't feel as efficient because of that. So I just go on this. It's quick. It's easy. And I just run through the content. So I'll just show you a, a, just a quick run through here, guys. Um, let's just see how quickly this takes. It doesn't take long. You're looking at maybe like a minute or so, basically. I mean, I go through and I end up doing all this. I mean, you don't have to do all this. I just do this because, you know, after a while, it's not... Let's be honest, this isn't the most fun encounter in the world, is it? Um, but it's not about that. It's about efficiency. Um, what you want to do is take out the boss here. Uh, so let's just take out this dude. Just like that. This guy. Kill this guy here. And then you'll get a couple of rounds that'll come out this door over here. Sometimes they spawn on the uh, on the right over here. But most of the time they come out of this door here. This one right here. It's just a case of standing here and basically taking them out. Um, you normally get two or three waves. Sometimes you'll get like a Warhound round, which again is just... There you go, done. And that was 50 seconds that took me. Um, and then basically all you're going to do, as I said, is you throw down your sticky, throw down your grenade... start again and as you've seen from experience you you do get a hell of a lot of experience doing this uh, a lot quicker than any other activity in the game i mean um there are other activities in the game that are very quick that will give you quick experience but nothing as reliable as this i mean you can go around the map looking for you know resource convoys and all that sort of stuff but nothing is going to give you um the the amount of experience this gives you this quickly I can, get, I can guarantee you. There's a reason why this is still the number one way to get up to Season Pass 100. Because it's it's effective. It works every single time. There's really no reason why you shouldn't be doing this, of course. Unless you just want, unless you just want to go through it normally. And of course that's fine. But I assume if you're watching this video, that the reason you're watching this video is because you're wanting to know the fastest way to get through this content. And this is the fastest way. I mean, there were, don't get me wrong, so I... I'm about to go down here. Uh, there will be some times where, uh, you know, you, even for someone like me, don't get me wrong, I'm not the best at this game, but struggle, not struggles, but has, uh, you know, a little lapse in uh, con uh, concentration here. Obviously, if I get closer, then I'll get the the, uh, 
the buff here. But yeah, that was done pretty easily. And look at the, the, the 660,000 experience from that. So, I mean, that's pretty much almost a whole level. I mean, don't get me wrong, we are on the... Um, I think at the first 15 levels of this uh, season pass, it's double XP, so it's obviously not that much. But at the moment, at least for the first 15 levels, it's basically one run. So every 50 seconds is, or well, whatever, it's one rank. Uh, and then up to level, and then after that point, you're looking at what, every two, two and a half runs, you'll be getting up um, to uh, the levels. So it's, it's, it's so quick, guys. It's unbelievable. Obviously, like I said, it's not, not I wouldn't say it's fun, uh, at all. Uh, it, it is a, a process, but Season Pass 100, it's uh, yeah, it's pretty easy to do, um, and I'd recommend doing this because at the end of the day, Season Pass 100, if you don't do this, will take quite a long time. Well, certainly it will take a much longer than we'll be doing this, and there are some good rewards, especially towards the end of the Season Pass. You've got your exotics, um, you've got your masks and whatnot. I think I, I did cover this in today's video, but just towards the end, I'm at 16. Um, I've, I've only done I haven't done that much to be fair. I've not been playing for that long, maybe an hour or so, probably less than that actually. But obviously, once you get towards the higher ends, then you do get, you know, your exotic caches. You've got the Picaro's holster there for the blueprint. Um, uh, we've also got the busy little bee exotic pistol, that's level 85. And that'll take you a little while to get to if you're not doing some kind of XP farm. Uh, we've got the bloody knuckles as well, which is 90. Uh, we got the exotic caches, and of course we got the new uh, the, the level 100 mask, the error mask as well. So if you wanted to get to those rewards as fast as po possible, then guys, please do this method. And just let me reiterate here, it has to be this encounter, okay? The easiest way to do it that I found is running from levels 1 to 9 on normal, breezing through that content in no time. When you get to level 10, if it's not this encounter, kill yourself. Go back into the encounter until this encounter comes up, okay? Uh, and then do it on whatever difficulty you want. So you can do it on heroic, you can do it on challenging, normal, whatever's easiest for you. I'd always recommend adding some directives in there because there's quite a lot of directives that, for such a brief run, you can have them. So stuff like ammo hoarders and stuff like that, you can put in there because it's such a quick run that it's not going to affect you in the long term. <laughs> Excuse me. I've got five, so yeah, there's, there's plenty of stuff that you can go in there. Um, uh, and you can get that experience. I think with five, that's an that extra 125% experience. So it's quite a lot. There you go, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this one. Let me know what you think about this in the comments down below. Like I said, not a new video. It's an old one. But there's a lot of new people that wouldn't know this. So there you go. Till the next one. Epic out.